Round four of the under 20s. Six Nations is underway and Jack Lloyd starts and pins the French side deep into their own half. Morgan Lloyd digs for it. Back on the angle comes one of the smallest players on the field in Harry Houston. Woodman slightly overran it, but France were offside and advantage being played for high tackle. Now it's Jack's opportunity to give Wales an early lead. Nice and easy. 3 0, five minutes on the clock. Jano, width from France, numbers as well, beautifully offloaded, well executed, well finished, and France scored the first try, thanks to Fonicola. To Fonicola, and on his international debut at under-20s level, Roman Fonicola. Sa. <laughs> To the backs they come as the giant, powerful Louis Lebron in midfield. Stolen, but offside against Ben Gregory. And a big call now for France. And strikes the ball with such confidence. And France are up to 10 now. More pressure from the French. Forwards keeping possession, rolling towards that try line. Looking for a second try. Sazi there, not quite. Jano wants possession, tells the forwards to keep it. Wales the under there. the pump here. Already conceded one try. There's the ball hidden here. Does it get to the try line? The referee is probably placed in a better position than anybody. I have no. Um evidence to overrule your on-field decision so stick with the try okay thank you it's a try yeah. rare visit to the french 22. Well, that was planned on the train if you and benji williams is rolling backwards towards the try line and he's within the meter and it's a penalty try the loose head prop look at him he's trying his best to drag it down um, absolutely the right call and fair play to the referee, no messing about, no more warnings, straight under the post, the yellow card. Patience needed from the Welsh defence attack, Williams, the big lock, Williams still going, and Williams dabs it down, he claims the try, that's what it means for big Benji Williams. There was no stop, he wasn't passing, <laughs> and there was no stopping it, was there? from the pitch, number 10, Emil Dryal, and he's been replaced by number 20, Ben, Kylian Tony Sarant. When he's off the ground. No, 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 no attempt to catch the ball. No attempt no to catch the ball. They're calling the ear directly into the yellow card. Then he's going to be marching for someone and Foodie accepts his punishment. Involved once again, lethargic in his style. But he's so impactful, and a penalty is coming against Wales. The half, yeah, that, that was no clear. If you notice there, um, Morse's hands were on the floor before touching the ball. You can't do that. So this will be the final action of an absorbing first half. France started well. Two tries, converted by Barre. And now he adds a late penalty. And he'll be putting the squeeze on that Welsh front row, but it's corner style pops. Number three and five. Right? And the impact they've had is that's another penalty, and Barre clips it over. Showing some symptoms. Great kick again, deep into that corner. It makes a real big difference to be five oh. out. France, sensing blood, Sa. Too powerful, too physical, too fast for, for Wales. You know, he breaks off. It's a gutsy move to break off. You only break off if you know you're going to score. And as Barry looks to add the extras, which he does with supreme confidence, solid scrum. And Wales rather uneasy in midfield, and it's lofted. 
and it's thrown out and it's a walk-in for Enzo Rebier. Bonus point for France. It's a great read, but Joe Hawkins had to go for that pass, you know what I mean? He, he's got to throw it. Good. Hawkins, charged down. Stolen, and it could be on here for France. Beautiful offload, beautiful finish. Tyrell with a touchdown. Forces Hawkins to do something extraordinary. Doesn't come off. Here we go. One last shot at it. Oriak. Oriak pushes it through and gives chase. Good footballing skills. There's the panache of the French. So dangerous, even in the final minute. I bet you they're glad to see that. That is some finish. Fair play to him. Foot on the gas. Perfectly weighted kick. Well, there we go. That's the final score. Wales were in the game for the majority of it, but France was simply too good, too strong, too powerful, too organised. And they eventually win this evening by 47 points to 15.